we've already got the head here and just like I did before I'm going to try and get parts of it that I can measure off and it's going to be this part here that I think will be good for measuring off. So I'll get this section. You can see why now I've done the top bit. It just gives me an entirely different view so I can work out how to do my wire, how to do big things. Okay, so I've got that part of the body. Now, how many of those parts of the body goes into here? One and a bit, just like before, obviously. One and a bit. Let's just double check that measurement. One. You can almost do two, so one, almost two. Let's pop it about there. Okay, so now get this part, the bottom part of my bug, my praying mantis. It's all segmentized and I'll do that in a minute. I'll just work out where to put this. And that's the wing there. So that'd be the wing doubled over. I might even, when I do my sculpture, maybe have the wings out, but for now I'm just going to draw it with the wing going across. That's the pattern of it. Perhaps I can use my wire when I make the wing. Use the same sort of pattern. And then I can see that the abdomen, let me cross there, along like that. Okay, now, there's something on the end here, which wasn't on my other drawing, but anyway. Maybe we'll pop it in because it's kind of interesting. Like little stingers. I'll have to do some research and find out what that part's for. Okay, the next thing I need is my legs. Okay, so there's a part here. Goes like so. Then there's a section here that goes like so. And then I've got a line that goes down here. Okay, now, this part of the leg, how big is it? If I get my pen, go like that, it's almost the same size as this, coming out. And if I go on an angle like that even, I can see that it's coming out here. So, get my leg. Part of the leg, top part. Now I'm going to measure. Oh, look, a bit pen, doesn't matter. Next time I'll use a better one, but it's just a sketch for a sculpture. It's not going to be a major artwork, so that's fine. Okay. This it goes all the way to where his eye is. Can you see that? Okay. Up and over down, across, now a little section that goes down like so and it's got another little piece coming down there which is going to be really interesting with the wire and coming down there like that. Also there's some other parts that are coming out that would be pretty cool with wire. Obviously the more detail I do the more difficult this wire sculpture is going to become. Now, when I'm actually making this wire sculpture, I might find that I don't even worry about some of these details, but it's good to have it in my drawing to start off with so I can play around with it and be creative. Okay, I knew that that part was going to be that high. I also know that the next part is going to be that high because they're legs that are exactly the same as each other. It's just repetition, boys. So there. And across there. There. Once again, little section here, there, there. Now when you do your drawings, and if it's not perfect, it doesn't matter. Just as long as we've got some ideas about how we're going to go about doing our sculpture, if you can make it accurate, it would be good. But if it's not perfect, as I said, it does not matter. Okay, so, eh, around about the same size as that, yeah? Coming from the body about there coming out a bit so I would say start here go up to there go down now that part is 
around about the same size as that by the looks of it. So probably to about here. Okay. And then coming down, we've got a leg. And then we just continue with the same process. I can see that that goes to there. I'm just comparing one thing with another now with my eyes. I don't need to measure that one so much. Now I've chosen myself a fairly intricate sort of insect. If you don't feel confident, you should try and do something a little bit simpler. You could just do a simple bug, like a lady beetle maybe, something like that, or perhaps a Christmas beetle. This is going to be around about the same size, in fact it is going to be the same size, so I may as well just measure straight off that. Coming up to here. Starting at the same location. Same length there. One, two, three. Okay, there. Coming through. Got this other section. It'd be the same length as that. Okay, same length here again. Okay, the cockatoos are going absolutely insane. Must be feeding time. And oh, down here. Coming down here. And there we have it. Prey mantis from Okay, as if you're looking at it from above. Now we have our two drawings. I've got some ideas. I need to go and get some wire now. And you know what else would be good? Supplies.